Hail you Hermaniacs, it's Hilmanator. Thought it might be interesting for some of you to see what the week in my life is like as a university student. So it's 10.30 in the morning and I'm just going to head down to the library to finish off some work on my essays, which are due for tomorrow. This is Norman, by the way. I've uh, finished up with that essay for now. I'm just heading back to the flat so that I can uh, get ready to go into town, have a look around for some Christmas shopping and stuff, and then go to church. I don't know how socially acceptable it is to film here, but I'm doing it anyway. Um, I've just finished up my shopping, didn't really get anything, but hey ho. Uh, heading off to church now, hopefully should be good. Turns out I came into town completely pointlessly, because church isn't actually where it normally is, and I have no way of finding out where it is. Brilliant. Well, I can actually see the floor now, so um, that's progress. Anyway, I need to get on with those essays. Yeah, it's not going to time lapse well. It's 6.30, so I'm going to take a short break. I'm going to make up a meal, do some washing up, and then I'll get right back to it. And today at Hillman's restaurant we have the lovely tinned chili con carne with the uh, boil in the bag rice. Really putting all the effort in. Mmm, now doesn't that just scream appetizing? Now this tasted absolutely bloody awful. So what am I going to do with the rest? Fruit it! Fruit it! Save it for tomorrow, naturally. Because as a student, you really can't afford to be too picky about what you have for lunch. In it goes. Ready for tomorrow. I think I'm going to pull an all-nighter to make sure that both of these essays are as good as I can possibly get them. They are already complete, but I need to make sure that they're up to snuff. Plus, I've got tomorrow free essentially, except for having in the essays, so I'll be fine. Okay, I'm uh, gonna get back to it now. Forgot to do my washing up earlier, so I'm gonna do my gown. Fruit it! Fruit it! And then I'm gonna make myself a great big cup of tea, because you always need some tea. It 
not acceptable to use multiple tea bags when making up a litre of tea, right? Well, I'm gonna do it anyway. Submitted it the first one at least. I've uh, still got another one to go. Fortunately, this one should be far less work, it's far more ready than the other one was. Um, but I have already got through my litre of tea. I need to make another. <laughs> got my refill ready to plow on. If you're wondering what music I was listening to earlier when. Uh, do my essays, it was my carbon music playlist. I also quite often listen to previous playlists that I made on Spotify back when I was 13 because I haven't used Spotify since then. And right now, I'm listening to a series of uh, seminars from the new days that I've been to in the past. Just spent an hour fighting my printer to get one essay printed off. I'm not much closer to having the other one finished, and it's 4:07. I mean, I'll get it done in time, but. <sighs> it's a good thing I had that second cup of tea. My head is killing from caffeine consumption because I've had two litres of tea. But on we go. So, after even more fighting with my printer, at 6am, I am now heading over to an independent study area because my printer just doesn't want to work. So, I'm now having to waste the limited credit that I have from the uni to try and print off something over here. Got it. Unfortunately, my alarms may have gone off while I was out, so... There's a small chance I might have broken up the guy in the room next to me. Hopefully not. But that's what I'm running back to check now. Yeah, I think we can officially count it morning now. And now, at 7.30 in the morning, I can finally relax and watch Doctor Who. Because it's a beautiful day and I can't stop myself from smiling. I got my philosophy paper in, now I've just got to go and hand in my uh, film one and somehow pass the uh, duck army. I managed to get it handed in, don't worry, and I was in time. Lancaster University is divided up into colleges. Now, my college, Pendle, is having a winter formal at the start of December and uh, I have to buy my tickets for it and organise it for a couple of other people. So that's all I've got today and then I've essentially got the rest of the day free. Not quite sure what I'm going to do with it, but uh, let's see. Let's get in the line now before it gets any larger. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. I know I shouldn't have, but I was flipping hungry, okay? And like, I haven't had breakfast yet, so... All right, so I am now headed off to Archery Society. Uh, hopefully I'll get some decent shots in. I used to be an adventurer like you, but then I took an hour into me. finished heading back to the flat now got to do some reading not sure when it's for because uh, some of my seminars get cancelled if I've had like essays or anything due recently so I'm gonna go over my film reading just in case and then I will make up myself some dinner So I uh, popped into the central, the student union run shop on campus. I also got myself my ticket for the college winter ball, which should be good. That's occurring on the 5th of December. I picked up a copy of Scan, 
which is the student-run newspaper in Lancaster. Mostly, the reason why I picked it up is because one of my friends has actually had two articles published in there, and I've just read through them, and they've done a really great job. If you're watching this, you know who you are. Thumbs up. So, I was uh, eating my fajitas when my friend sent me a link showing the uh, Stanley, the genius behind many a famous uh, Marvel character and many of the heroes of my childhood had uh, sadly passed away today. It's um, it's weird to think that someone is alive as uh, as he seemed to be could just no longer be around anymore. Um, obviously. I didn't know him personally, this uh, doesn't affect me personally, but uh, my thoughts go out to the family and friends of Stan, I know this has been a, uh, a difficult year for them, for a variety of reasons, but uh, I pray that God can uh, provide them with peace in this uh, time of hardship and uh, that they might always remember Stan as the brilliant man that he was. I, uh, I don't have much else to say on this. Certainly a way to end the day. It's uh, just on midnight, and I may have forgotten to mention that my room is right over a bus stop. So I get all of the joys of hearing all the people who were going out clubbing for both my college and another college. It's great. I was right, my seminar was cancelled, so instead I'm going to go have my breakfast a bit early. So, normally on a Tuesday... One minute. Ah, oh, that's better. Where was I? Oh yeah. Normally on a Tuesday, I would have a 11 o'clock seminar, which would be to do with film, and it would be an hour long. Uh, basically, we would talk about the films that we had watched that week um, before the seminar started. Then, once it started, we'd talk about the reading that we had for that week, the things that had been talked about in the lecture, and the film that we watched as part of our course. But because I had no lecture on Friday, but last Friday, because of the coursework that I had to do. There is no film seminar today, and so I basically just have to sit around until my two o'clock lecture, which is not film, it is philosophy. So, as it turns out, I may just be incapable of reading a clock, because, as you can see, my lecture is actually at four. So, considering I've got effectively four hours to kill, I am going to edit together to start this video. That's everything, right up till now, including this clip, edited in. It's quarter past three, um, I am now headed to my first lecture of the week, uh, which is going to be philosophy. I'm very familiar with this topic. I actually studied it at A level. This is Marvel's being concerned what we ought to do. Um, Marvel's being concerned with what we ought to do. 
abstract questions. Um, questions like, uh, why do you think that some brains are abstract? Always try and find some understanding. That's philosophy done for today. Um, I'm just going to head home now, uh, make up some dinner, maybe do a bit of reading on uh, Mill, and then not sure about the rest of the evening, so. I also just wasted a load of time watching YouTube. If you don't know who these guys are, it might be worth checking out some of their content. Let's test it out. Hello, I'm Tyler. This is the imaginary axis, and how do Pokeballs work? All the while, that nagging desire to make a big boy film was growing stronger and stronger. And I told myself I had one year to make it happen, or I'd give up the dream, go back to work at the local ABC affiliate and settle for being a lifetime journalist or TV news producer or You guys need anything? Some snacks? A condom? Let me know. Oh, God love you. Face it, video game movies suck. That's blasphemy! <laughs> and today at Hillman Restaurant we have chicken soup. Because we're really putting all the effort in on our meals. I call it the soup wrap. The reason I was having such a simplistic meal was because there was a talk I wanted to go to about the uh, racial divide in America. But, um,. Apparently, you could only go to it if you're part of the politics society, and I am not. And I do not want to have to pay to join the politics society just so that I can go to this talk. So, yeah, that's a, that's a bit of a bummer. Oh well. Just gonna grab myself a snack, and then um, I believe I have a seminar tomorrow in religious studies so i need to do my reading for no this is not a brand deal though if it was i'd be very proud of myself uh i just fancy doing a bit of a time lapse i've got 11 pages to read through let's do this you know you should probably go to bed when you start translating a hymn into japanese i've made my bed now to sleep in it it's 5 a.m I've uh, tried to go to sleep and I haven't been able to. Good morning everyone. This morning I have got a philosophy lecture and then I am going on to a religious study seminar. Then I have an hour free and I may have a surprise in store. Just finished my uh, philosophy work. Heading over to my RS seminar now. You said there was a surprise, Josh. I'm getting to it, Darren. The surprise being that I'm... I am going to be on the Lancaster University radio. Well, that was fun. We listened to all sorts of protest songs and just had a bit of a chat. And now I'm headed back to my flat so that I can get ready to go to the gym because I only have about two hours where I can actually go a uh, day. <laughs> right, you've been to the gym, now I can leave, yeah? First hour, running, uh, leg pressing, cross training and rowing, and now I'm going to see if the pool's open, so I can do some swimming. Don't I look good? 
just finished my swim and my workout. Headed back to the flats now. Uh, I've got some reading to do because... Pro tip! Pro tip! When you're a student, you will always have reading to do. Look at that sky. Just booking for Christmas now. Tickets are booked. Christmas can't come soon enough. Sorry that I didn't film anything after that last night. Nothing really happened, I basically just went to sleep. And this morning all I've done is have my philosophy seminar. Now I'm just heading back over to the radio station because I'm doing that again today. And then I'll have my RS lecture this afternoon. And that's my time on the radio done for the week. Heading back to the flat now to eat some lunch. So I'm uh, at my RS lecture and Nobody's here. It's 10 minutes past. They should have arrived by now. And I've looked online. I've looked at the E stuff. They, there's no particular reason as far as I can tell. I need. I checked iLancaster. I've checked Moodle and my email from the university. There's no mention of anything. I'd say I've waited long enough. Wouldn't you? I honestly have no clue. I'm just going to head back to my accommodation and hope for the best. Just to establish, that's normally a two hour lecture. Since I've got this slot free and most people are going to be in lectures, I'm going to do some of my washing. Pro tip! Pro tip! Always bring more clothes to uni than you think you could possibly need. You'll find space for them and it means you'll have to do less dealing with these things. Laundry is flipping expensive. Wait, Josh. How does having more clubs not mean you have to do more laundry? Surely you'd have to pay for more machines. I can see why you'd think that, Darren. But, um, actually... Truth is, as long as you're dividing it correctly, you can cram it all into one machine. Um, obviously, when I say dividing it, I mean between colours, darks, and lights. Those are the only three categories you need to worry about and yeah you will have to pay for a machine for each of them but it means you can get all of your things from one particular category into one machine which means you only end up paying for three washes rather than seven. While my washing gets done I can watch some TV. It's getting quite late now and I have lectures and other stuff all from 9 in the morning until theoretically until 1 uh, tomorrow so I shall see you then. Good morning! I think it's a tad bit late. I've got my film lecture now and then after that I'm going to actually watch a film. Can't quite remember what it is this week but um, I'll fill you in in the gap between the lecture and the thing. Anyway, gotta go because I'm running late. Made it with time to spare. It's 10 a.m. The lectures have just finished, uh, and now we're about to watch On the Waterfront, which is an example of some method acting. Which we we were talking about different performing styles in the lecture. When I say watching. I don't mean strictly speaking watching per se, as you would a regular film, because we have to be continuously making notes and whatnot throughout, as you would expect. That's the film over and also everything I've got to do today in terms of actual timetable stuff. Just heading back to my flat now. I think I'm gonna head into the library, do some reading after lunch. So yeah. It's been a couple of hours, I'm back in my room after doing some reading. In about an hour I'm gonna make my, up myself some uh, food. Well, then I think I'm just gonna play some games on the PlayStation because why the heck not? I just played a little Injustice, won every match obviously. Then I went to archery for a bit and yeah. Now that archery's over, me and a couple of the guys from the flat below are gonna head on out into town. As of right now, I'm just in my uh, college bar where they're having a bit of a rock fest. But So our initial plan to get the free university run bus to the university nightclub has failed due to overcrowding. So we're now all running to the main bus stop 
see if we can get a bus from there. So blooming typical, I uh, forgot my ID, so now I'm running back to my flat to grab it. Got it. I ran all the way across campus, got all the way back, and then, just as I got on the bus, there was one guy in the line in front of me, no more people. Everyone else had already got on, so they've all got off, and now I have to wait for the next bus. Hopefully it should be soon. in my flat it's uh just gone 320 i only came back because everyone else in my friends were already heading back the cheeky uh cheeky burger and chips which was quite cheap actually so i feel justified in doing that just all going to bed now i mean to be honest i'm not really tired but what can you do i'm still sober for those of you wondering uh all i had was six VKs and two double vodka Red Bulls, so not much. All right, night. It was fine. Uh, had some fun with friends. Uh, see you tomorrow for the last day. Good morning on this fine day. Saturday morning. Uh, I haven't got anything to do really today, so I'm just gonna do some more reading and take it from there. I've done a couple of hours of reading, and I've had my lunch, and I watched Blackadder the third, because I wanted to. I'm just going to do my washing up now, because I've got quite a bit of it. Not sure how much else I'm going to get up to today, so I may not even record this day, really. Sorry. It's just nothing interesting is really happening. I really have nothing else going on tonight, so um, I think I'm just going to call it an end to the vlog there. hope you enjoyed it. If not, then sorry, I realise this has been long. You probably haven't watched it all this way if you didn't enjoy it though, so... But if you did, what are you doing? Oh yeah, one more thing. For those of you who don't know, I have a Facebook page, which will help keep you up to date with my videos and my misadventures, so... If you want to go and give that a like, you can do. Okay, thanks for watching all. I'll catch you next time.